I'm a professional triathlete. When I first started my triathlon career, I had some issues with blood supply to one of my legs. I had to have a surgery. When I was pregnant, my obstetrician was asking me about sort of medical history, uh, surgery history, and you know, trying to find the details of that meant me remembering the surgeon's name, her ringing the surgeon, them you know, consulting, having conversations, and trying to figure out what had happened. I had my daughter 13 months ago. When she was seven months old, I developed pain in my back and ended up having an MRI. First MRI didn't show anything. I was referred on to a sports specialist. Um, he had a look digitally at the, the MRI that I'd already had. And first he sent me for a bone scan that um, also didn't have any definitive answers. So then he decided to send me for a, another MRI. And the second MRI revealed I had a stress fracture in my lower back. It was sort of one of the side effects of being pregnant and breastfeeding. All of these records were stored digitally. We can just log on to my health record and everything's right there. It's not relying on me recalling everything that's happened these last few years. It's all right there and I can share it with any medical professionals that I need to. So the physio, the doctor and my GP. My usual sports doctor who's sort of been along for the journey with me for, the, for a long time. And then with pregnancy and having my daughter Marley, you throw in an obstetrician and a paediatrician. Could all confer and look at these results online. I spend sort of between three and seven hours a day training, swimming, cycling and running. Swim squad in the morning, it starts at 5.30, be an hour and a half to two hours of swimming, five to six kilometres. And then I'll come home, have breakfast, spend some time with my daughter. I take her to daycare and then I'll head out on the bike for three to five hours. Then later in the afternoon, I'll have a run. Me, my husband and my daughter Marley, we all head over to the US. I'm gonna spend a month training in Colorado at high altitude and then I'll go to a competition, an Ironman race in Canada. If that goes well, then I'll be qualified for the World Ironman Championships in Hawaii. I now have that peace of mind that if I need access to any of my health records or my daughters, we can just log on to my health record and everything's right there. So yeah, it's brilliant.